Hello, everyone. This is Tom Fox. I would like to welcome you to the Sunday Book Review. The Sunday Book Review is the series where I discuss books which impact the compliance practitioner, the legal professional, and the business professional. I hope you will enjoy this episode. The Sunday Book Review is a production of the Compliance Podcast Network. First, a quick word from our sponsor. In this special Labor Day weekend edition of the Sunday Book Review, we take a look at the L.A. Quartet uh, books from author James Elroy. We're going to do them in order of reading them. The first is The Black Delilah. On January 15, 1947, the torture-ravaged body of a beautiful young woman was found in a L.A. vacant lot. The victim makes headlines as the Black Dahlia, Dahlia, and so begins the greatest manhunt in California history. Caught up in the investigation are Bucky Blackert and Lee Blanchard, warrant squad cops, friends, and rivals in love with the same woman, but are both obsessed with the victim. Driven, driven by dark needs to know everything about her past, to capture a killer, and to possess the woman even in death. Their quest takes them on a hellish journey through the underbelly of post-war Hollywood to the core of the girls, the dead girls' twisted life at past extremes of their own psyche into a region of total madness. Next up, the big nowhere. The DA's brass, a sheriff's deputy, and a rough-and-tumble bagman are the unknowing, unknowingly chasing a nightmare in this thrilling novel. Uh, 1950s L.A., the commie scare and a string of brutal, brutal mutilation killings, gangster intrigue, and Hollywood sleaze. Three cops are caught in a hellish web of ambition, perversion, and deceit. Danny Upshaw is a sheriff's deputy stuck with a bunch of snuffs nobody cares about. They're his to make his name as a cop to sate his darkest curiosities. The DA's Bureau Brass is climbing on the Red Square scare, rather, bandwagon to advance his own career and to gain custody of an adopted son. All three are there to um, purchase tickets to the nightmare. L.A. Confidential, my personal favorite, and uh, the book that really made uh, a great movie. This is an epic noir crime novel uh, with the uh, detail and scope of the first two books. It involves mass murder, invading the lives of victims and victimizers on both sides, and lawmen caught in a deadly spiral of nightmare that tests loyalty and their courage. And then finally... White Jazz, 1958, killings, beatings, bribes, shakes down. It's standard procedure for Lieutenant Klein of the LAPD. He's a slumlord and a bagman and an enforcer all in one. He um, is a power in his own small corner of hell. He's been hung out as bait, however, and the heat's coming from all sides. Local politicians, LAPD brass, drug dealers, and racketeers. Klein tells his own story, his voice clipped and sharp, as riveting and honed to a razor's edge. The White Jazz is great fiction, a great story. Really read any of these books, and they're fabulous. Even if you've seen L.A. Confidential, the novel is much richer and much better. So check out James Elroy. The Compliance Podcast Network was recently honored with some communicator awards for podcasts I know you will want to check out. Are you interested in Lyme disease? Well, check out Understanding Lyme Disease. And check out the Hill Country Podcast, where I look at the people, places, and things of the Texas Hill Country. Also, we have a new podcast series on the Compliance Podcast Network, which I know you will enjoy, The Corruption Files, where together with Hughes Hubbard partner Mike DeBernardis, we take a look at the some of the most significant FCPA and international anti-corruption enforcement actions over the past 15 years. It's a great review and helps you understand how we got to where we are today in ABC compliance. And we actually have one more, which is Taxman on the intersection of tax and compliance, where with my 
tax colleague extraordinaire, Tracy Howell, we look at five different issues that every compliance officer needs to be aware of regarding corporate tax. It's a fascinating series that's on a topic not often explored. This podcast is a part of the C-Suite Radio Network. For more top business podcasts, visit c-suiteradio.com.